That's a lot of nuts! Meme. Mail, baby. You know a series is official when I don't take an entire year to do another episode of it. It's only been four months this time, and you guys have sent all these wonderful gifts for me to unbox on camera directly to my P.O. box, which is linked. You know the joke already. I don't have an order for what I think I should open. I'm gonna sort of work my way oh my from God. top to bottom. Let's start with this thing. I've covered up everybody's names with duct tape as always, so you don't need to worry about me accidentally doxing you like the first four episodes. Signed off to Sumeto, buy your own G Fuel media. As if I can't buy my own G Fuel? This isn't even G Fuel, it's Juju professional grade gaming formula. I'm not doing an ad read for this. I don't know who these guys are. It's got Himalayan pink salt in it. Everybody knows a salty energy drink's the best energy drink. There's probably a joke about semen in there somewhere, but I'm not gonna make it. Let's try and guess what's in these things. This one's got like a bubble rib cage around it. I'm thinking this has to be glass. I'm gonna say a souvenir mug. This one's to Sumeto Media at PO Box 5011, wrong phone number. That's me. It's always great when you open something and it's staring right back at you. What the fuck is this thing? Wait, is this one of those dancing toys that sings back whatever you say to it? You guys can leave notes. You don't just have to be like anonymous weirdo sending me stuff. You can send a note that gives me some contacts. Well, there is a tag on it, but the tag's in Chinese. BG. Oh, he's got a little sombrero. Look at him. Oh, that's nice. Look at him. Oh, fuck, I'm covering his face. He can't breathe. He can't breathe. No, he's okay. Listen, I'd love to demonstrate this dude dancing, but I don't own batteries because it's 2023 and everything's rechargeable nowadays. Please don't be something ironic. Just a piece of paper that says Le Junk Man. Got There's it. nothing else in here. You spent like $3 on stamps for this? All right, envelopes are stupid. Don't open envelopes. Envelopes are a waste of time. This one's to Sumeto Chan, P.O. Box 5011. That's me. I see a t-shirt. Hold on, this one's actually got a note. Thank goodness. Maybe we'll get some context for this. Howdy, Sumeto. What'd it do, my die? I'm a, how did, what? I'm having a stroke. Okay, so it's a t-shirt that you can buy for some life-saving surgery for a cat? I'm down. If you guys want to send me stuff from your online store or your company that wants products reviewed or whatever, feel free to send them, but actually send me a thing. This is excellent. I love it. And it feels like it's going to a good cause. Go help out the sick kitty, right? Buy some shirts. But I had a dude send me some postcards. I was like, yo man, shout out my YouTube channel. Fuck you. For what? The 75 cents it costs you to send a postcard? No. Oh no, this is going to be a lot of layers. Layers. There's no note. It says thought cops. Aren't these guys YouTubers? Thanks for the sweater. I don't, I don't watch these guys though. That sweater might've come from a fan of Thought Cops and not the Thought Cops guys themselves. I don't want to assume they want to have me on the podcast because again, I'm not even sure that they are a podcast. This t-shirt is ridiculously comfy and the eyes glow in the dark. This, this is cool. I like this. If you remove the S from your name, your YouTube link would be youtube.com slash Kumito Media. You're welcome. Come. Sincerely a Cash Money Meme Team member. P.S. Pick related Mount Hood, more like Mount Hood of Sumetos. I don't get it. Let's do this big boy. This this thing's got some heft to it. This is to Sumeto Media to P.O. Box. Wrong phone number. What? Do they not have my phone number at the post office? That's it? It's just a big pillow? My guess is another one of these boxes is going to utilize this pillow. I think this is package two of a two-part package. Uh, I'm gonna go with an Xbox controller. It's definitely not, but that's my guess. Heat Hot Sauce Shop from heathotsauce.com. They sent me a hot sauce? Oh no, they literally sent me the bomb beyond insanity. The worst hot sauce on all of hot ones. I fucking hate you guys. I don't know if I consider myself good with hot sauces. I think I honestly consider myself pretty bad with spicy food. But the bomb beyond insanity is the one that sets everybody's fucking cock on fire on hot ones. I'm gonna go with a drop and nothing more than a drop. And I'm throwing this out the fucking window if this kills me. Three, two, one. You guys think it's more hot or less hot if you get it on chicken wings? I already feel it heating up. I'm sure this won't go poorly. This one's to Sumeto Media, that's me. I wonder what this could be. Oh, this one's got a note, how nice. I hope it's not ruined by the fact that my mouth is on fire. Pollinator Habitat, 
microgreens pop-up garden. It's something you can put on your windowsill to grow a salad. How nice is that? I really wish I had a salad. Come on. Get through the episode, Cement. Get through the episode. You got this. This package is green. Let's go for this one. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Fuck. It's just some sort of black case. There's gonna be something in it, I think. Ah, uh, man. I thought this hot sauce would be wearing off by now. Is this the whole Yu-Gi-Oh cards? I don't... There's no marking or anything. I don't have any context for this. Solar Wobble. It's a dancing hula girl. I'm gonna assume you're from Hawaii. Ohana. <coughs> this one costs $17 to ship and it's in a box. Oh, here's the bed sheet for whatever it is. Oh, and there's actually a note. Thank God. Give me some context, please. Hi, Sumeto. This is your longtime follower, Joey. You may remember some of the meme stickers I sent you in the past. I do. And there's more in here. Why did I do that? I wanted to send you some more meme stickers. And this sweater, I hope it's the right size to keep you at a warm and ha I'm hot enough, buddy. Your videos have brought me a huge amount of joy and happiness to me during an especially difficult year. Despite so many things changing in my life, I can always count on you to make me laugh. That means so much to the, the world is a better place with people like you in it. Thank you so much for all you do. Happy holidays. Thank you, Joey. Please have some ice cubes on it. What's it say? Where is it? What? Did it's just a sweat. It's just a plain sweater. You know what? It's my color though. I'll, I'll, I'll take this on it. And I want... Unironic. I'll wear this. <coughs> okay, last box. But it is the biggest box that we've got so far. Apologies for the late box. I tried to get this out before Christmas, but life happened and it started rain and then it started raining. Oh, it's so cute. Hi, Sumeto. I hope you've been having a great new year so far. It was good until the hot sauce. Please don't forget to stay hydrated and take care of yourself. You know what, Angie, that's a good fucking idea. You know what, maybe a little more water. This one's for you. Don't touch that mouse. You're watching Badlands Chugs. I don't think that helped at all. I've still got the card you sent before right here. I guess I'll put this one in front of the Vaporeon. Hey, look at that. I'm always very scared when I get packages from artistically inclined people because they have good taste and I don't. I know green tea and matcha are two different flavors of Kit Kat. I'm gonna assume this is green tea. Listen, I'll eat one, okay? If for no reason other than to get this hot sauce out of my mouth. I think this is green tea. So good, Japan's got the best stuff. Did you know they got 300 vending machines? A Yu-Gi-Oh card folder for your favorite special card. With anti-slip pockets, Angie? Oh, you spoil me. I'm gonna keep it in the packaging for now because I don't actually have any Yu-Gi-Oh cards to put into this. But when I eventually collect every edition of Dark Magician Girl, they're going in here, don't you worry. A Linkin Park Funko Pop? How, what, I've never even seen this, bro. I mean, like, let's be fair, everything gets a little bit shadowed by Meteora, but still, it's not like Linkin Park has a bad album. It's a Vaporeon Lego. Nanoblock Vaporeon. This probably won't be as difficult to build as a Gundam, but it will still be interesting to watch it build it on stream if you can. Listen, this I think I can figure out. I mean, it's only 140 pieces? Look, I'll, I'll do my best. That hot sauce is finally wearing off. Unironically, chugging an entire bottle of water did help. Oh, shit. Shit! Mini katanas. Here are some mini katanas, literally, from Mini Katana, the store. I got most of the anime katanas I use in my cosplays from Mini Katana. By the way, what's your favorite anime katana or sword? Like, there are some iconic ones, right? You've got the, you've got Kuwabara's sword, you've got, um... I never watched Roroni Kenshin. Roroni Kenshin used a sword, right? Wasn't that anime about swords? You're nuts. You're actually nuts. You've gone insane, Angie. Kentaro Miura's Berserk Deluxe Edition. Berserk Volume 1, I'm hoping you don't have any of the manga yet. And if you don't, this is your sign to get the rest. Also, what are some of the manga you already have? I don't have a ton of manga. I do want to start collecting them, but I'm tempted to get like series that are like secondhand so that I don't feel too bad about them getting dusty or broken up or whatever, because they're mostly gonna be for looks. A huge shout out to Ray, my graphic designer, who's done like all the artwork for my channel. She sent me this beautiful handmade leather wallet that she sells in her online store, brush-spirit.com. If you guys wanna support an artist that has supported me for a very long time in a new endeavor, please consider checking out her store. That will be linked below along with the 
link for this uh, cat t-shirt and the hot sauce company and anybody else. If you sent me something hoping to get some exposure for your brand or your online thing, uh, I hope you feel like you got some value out of it. I'll leave you linked in the description. To everybody else who sent me all these beautiful, thoughtful gifts and snacks and artwork and stickers, uh, from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much. I cannot express how nice it is to have these shelves just completely full of gifts and anime merch and manga that I would never take the time to buy for myself uh, and has instead been fully supplied by you guys. Thank you so much. If you want to send stuff for future episodes of Me Mill, uh, P.O. Box will be linked here and is always in the description. Shout out to the Patreon boys. Shout out to everybody who subscribed over the last couple of weeks as I've been trying to get my schedule back together. Hope you enjoyed this. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Spisu!